So today we're back in flashing lights and folks, we're going to become the most competent firefighter and we're totally not going to leave the job when it becomes too overwhelming for us. So be sure to hit that thumbs up for more flashing lights and let's jump in. All right, so we are set up and we're ready to go here. We are firefighters once again in flashing lights and folks, there's been an update. They finally have dynamic fire in this game. So if you recall, uh, whenever you used to play this game, uh, you get a fire call out. Uh, you'd have like a couple windows on fire and nothing would actually spread. Well, folks, that is all completely different. And I like the whole fact that I'm uh, missing the calls right now. But yeah, it's totally different because it now spreads. And yeah, I think that's going to be actually game changing because honestly, I didn't like to be the firefighter that much. Also, the uh, looks like the stations had a little bit of a revamp. I mean, this might have been updated uh, last time. Actually, I do remember the station being different, but that was in the old map. Uh, we haven't visited it here. Uh, let's see, there's a fire pole over here. Oh, that is so neat. I mean, we should probably wait for another call out here. Uh, here's the lockers. You got like your little uh, area where you sit down and I guess rest between calls. But you know what? Let's go use that fire pole real quick. And then uh, let's see what kind of fire trucks we have. We oh, okay. That was actually really quick. All right, it's going to here. So uh, let's go and open up the doors. Uh, that way we could just drive the truck right out. Where do we spawn the truck? Is it here in the front? Maybe it's here in the front. All right, so I found the spawn. So you have like your traditional truck here. You've got a ladder truck, which I think we should have this one out. Uh, so let's go ahead and spawn this real quick. Okay, so we have a call here. We have a structure fire with possible entrapment. Let's go ahead and accept this call here. All right, and let's see, where is this on the map? Uh, okay, so it's down in the bottom right in the beach town. So let's head out. We got a little ways to go here. Okay, let's go lights and sirens. Let's try not to hit some. Okay, we might have just plowed over some. Oh, never mind. They're okay. All right, we got to get rolling here. Will you get out of the way, miss? Why was that blocking the vehicle? I could barely turn there. All right, let's see if we can get everybody to clear out here. We need to make it down, like I said, to the beach town. We're going to have to jump on the highway here. Might have just plowed over a van. It is completely fine. We don't have any backup here today, so uh, that is not going to be a thing, which I kind of wish I would have brought a buddy. Seems like you need multiple people to fight fires, but uh, it'll be fine. We'll have to prioritize stuff. Maybe go for the victims first and then take care of the fire. All right, we are on 600 right now south, uh, heading towards the beach town. So I'm watching the active fires. It's growing. In the bottom right, it was at 1. Now it's at 5. Uh, this thing might be out of control by the time we get to it. All right, I'm gonna need everybody to clear out of my way. Uh, we got a emergency. Oh, geez. Okay. Man, the car's still kind of popping in front of you. It's a little distracting, not gonna lie. Yeah, they just need to stay out of my way. We have an emergency here. Oh, it's the gas station that's on fire. All right, so we have possible entrapment. We might have to uh, maybe bust in real quick to see if there's anybody trapped. Uh, we'll have to see. Let's go ahead and pull in here. Do we have a hydrant over here? Oh, yeah, there's a couple out here, here in the front. So we'll just pull about right here. There we go. All right, let's uh, let's get to work here. All right, let's go ahead and get some gear here. So this is the trunk. So let's go fire. Uh, let's go get our SCBA on real quick. And then let's get the, I think it's called the, is it the halogen? Uh, I believe this is what we use to break open doors. Let's go ahead and check. Oh, I see there's a body in there. Holy man, okay. You know, I'm not actually seeing fire, which is weird. Uh, wait, okay, nope, never mind. There's fire in the back. Uh, hey, are you dead? Uh, oh, I think this person might be dead. I need to interact with them real quick. Can we pull them out of the fire? Here, let's go ahead and pick them up here. We'll request a transport. There we go. Let's pull them out. Get them clear of the fire here. All right, so it's not a huge structure. Oh, I just kind of tossed him down there. All right, here, request transport. Our ambulance is in route. All right, so let's go back in one more time. Make sure there's nobody in the back. Uh, I don't see anybody else. I mean, if there's somebody back there, they're definitely dead right now. Uh, it says there's 15 active fires. What? Did you get 15 fires in there? Can we bust open the uh, door here in the back? Okay, so this is all open. All right, so it appears to be mostly on the roof here. Uh, there's a chance we might want to get in closer. We could get on the ladder. Here, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and get some hoses hooked up real quick. So let's go fire. Let's get a supply hose. And then we're going to go supply hose from here. And then let's hook it into the truck here. 
All right, so that should be good to go there. So we have supply, and then we're going to grab our actual, uh, I guess we call it the attack hose. Or they, I guess they just call it water hose here. Let's go ahead and do that, and we're going to hook it on this side of the truck. There we go. All right, and then we have two different spray uh, modes now for the uh, nozzle. I don't know, like maybe one's like a wide or something. I'm not really sure. All right, so let's go into here. Let's start, go ahead and hit it from the inside first. And then there's a chance we need to get a ladder here. Or we need to get on the ladder truck and work our way up. Yeah, this is going to be hard to fight just taking it out from in here. I think we need to get to the source, which I believe is going to be uh, definitely up high. But yeah, this makes the firefighting feel way more dynamic. Like, this feels pretty awesome. Uh, let's start spraying up here. We might be able to hit it all from here. Uh, let's see. Let's try to start covering the top here. Yeah, this is going to be really tough from this uh, angle. We definitely need to attack it from high. So, uh, we got the inside taken care of. Now, it is going to spread some more. That's now a feature. You no longer just knock it out and it's done. Okay, we are currently moving the truck. Uh, that way we can get the ladder up close. There we go. I think we could still probably get that supply line over here. I probably should have done that in the first place. Uh, I was kind of eager to go get the people out, though. All right, let's go fire. And then let's go ahead and go with that supply hose again. Hook it into the side. Will this run all the way out here? I think it will. I think we pretty much have infinite hoses here. Uh, water cannot be sent back to the hut. No. Uh, really? Do I have to hook it up on this side first? Okay, let's get the outriggers out real quick. That way we are uh, all the way good to go. I don't even remember how to do these. I think you just click them like this. Is that going out? Uh, that's the front here. Let's try the rears. Make sure we're actually working this right. It might need to go this way. Okay, there we go. So I see the rear coming out. And then let's go down. And we want to do the same thing to the front. That way we stabilize the truck when we're on the ladder. Okay, let's get up on the ladder here. We should be able to use the controls now. All right. Gotta hope that I remember how to do this. There we go. So we'll go over here. We should be able to attack it from the top. Is there a spray on the end of this one? That is a good question. Are we doing this for no reason? There's a chance we are. Uh, we're about to figure out, though. Also, I climb ladders really weird. That's... That's odd looking. No, there's definitely a hose on the end of this. All right, so ladder control. Can we can we use the hose here? Uh, okay, on off. So it's left, up, down, uh, on. I got this. I'm going to figure this out here at some point. Okay, turn this on. There it goes. All right, so let's go up and down. I, I think I can actually control this from the ground, but I've got a better look at it up here. So uh we're gonna use the ladder here to help put this out on oh, let's go a little up uh hold on maybe it's down down is up up is down okay so here we go up oh yeah we have this taken care of this is easy mode now this is perfect okay not that many active fires now i'm using the uh the actual ladder controls to help move this instead of the hose here or the uh the little end of it come on uh, maybe hit that side a little bit. This looks cool. Okay, so it said mission's cleared, even though there is still clearly fire on top of this. Also, 19 fire. Wait, is there another big fire somewhere else? Hold on. I feel like it's my duty to put this out because it said mission cleared, but I'm like, your gas station. It's still got flames on it. Like, we should clear that, right? I mean, you feel like that would be a thing. Hold on, go up here. Uh, I don't want to be the world's most incompetent firefighter, but there's a chance I'm going to be here. And you know what? I think we're going to call it here. I mean, it's still somewhat on fire, but uh, I think there's another fire somewhere else. Hold on. Let's go ahead and put this up here. Uh, we got a tree blocking a road. I am too important for that. I feel like I don't need to take calls where I use chainsaws unless I can chainsaw somebody. Uh, let's go look inside real quick. Is there still fire in here? Like, I don't. No, I don't think so. I think we're actually good. I think it's just smoldering now. We're just putting some extra water on it. Oh, and so if I check the map, I could have swore I saw... Okay. There's something that says 20 over there. It must be the trees. Uh, I thought maybe there was another fire. Oh, boy. We got a little bit to clean up here. All right. Let me reset everything. We'll get back to the station. But that's pretty much how the, uh, the fires work now, which... This works way better than it used to. So I'm checking out some of the other vehicles. Of course, you got some of these uh, like SUVs. You got like the Crown Vic, which I really think those are for like the fire chief or something. I don't think you really want to go to a scene with a lot of these. Uh, and then you got like the traditional looking truck and you had the big ladder truck. I like the ladder truck because it's really diverse and uh, you can get up on top of the buildings. But if we're playing multiplayer, probably use uh, this truck and the ladder truck here. 
But let's go ahead and make sure we have this one pulled out. I just wanted to check real quick to see if I wanted to switch vehicles. All right, so we're back in the city. We are ready for some more calls, which apparently there is a call somewhere. Hold on, let's go check our computer. Uh, let's see if it's a, a call worth taking. I don't want to go on the other side of the map again, even though technically it's my job to do that, but it's fine. All right, so pull up the computer. We'll go to the CAD here and, well, I guess whatever just happened, they probably died. It's fine. Hey, we have a structure fire. Code 3, location 2743. I don't know where that's at. Uh, we'll have to see. Hold on, shut this down. Structure fire, is it actually in the city today or is it across the map? Uh, no, we actually have one here in the city. Nice. All right, so let's go ahead. Fire up the engine here. Takes a second. And then let's get the lights and siren. Watch out, don't pull out in front of me. Uh, I ran over one of your buddies earlier. So I'm hoping this is one of the bigger buildings that's on fire. Uh, I don't want to see just like a little gas station. I'm just kind of curious how the fire spreads here. Oh, is it one of these buildings? Oh, it is. Oh, thankfully we brought the ladder truck. Okay, so let's see. Fire hydrant, fire hydrant. Is there one? Okay, there's one down the street, I think. Uh, it's fine. I think we need to plan ourselves about right here. So let's go ahead and block off the street. Uh, keep all that pesky traffic from interrupting and potentially running me over. All right, let's get out here and let's get to work. Okay, so I don't think we can actually get into this structure here. Hold on, let's get our supply hose. Oh, you got to be kidding me. All right, we got to do some sort of traffic control here. This is going to get to be ridiculous. Oh, where is it? Hydrant at. I like the whole fact that I can just draw with my uh, hose here. I've got like a limited hose. Oh, it's going to not let me go this way. I need to hook to the fire hydrant first. I got to remember that. Oh, I'm going to circle this person's car. You people are really in the way right now. This is interrupting my... Uh, my vibe here so i might have to hit somebody with something okay you are interrupting official fire business like i can't barely even get to my controls over here can i hit them with uh, the halogen is that a thing can i just come on just whack their car get you gotta be kidding me yeah how do you traffic control this you almost need multiple units here you need somebody to block the street i think i can use some of the traffic stuff but i think it's a little too late now uh, if i go to additional yeah i have traffic cones well, you know what? We already have people blocking, so we're not going to be able to use those. All right, let's go get a, a little bit of assessment here. Get a little 360, see what we... Oh, geez. Uh, this fire is spreading rapidly. Okay, there's no people, like, falling out of the building, is there? Uh, look around. Okay, so it's just a fire on the front end of the structure. We cannot go inside of this building, so... Uh, definitely using the ladder is gonna be the way to go here. Okay, I don't even have, think we have time for like the outriggers or anything, so we just need to get our cursor here. Okay, let's go up and then over to the left. Okay, so it's spread into the doorway. I like how there's people casually walking in front of this, like, oh, this isn't a big deal. Like, do firefighters have to deal with this on the normal? All right, come on, let's go on. All right, so we have unlimited supply here, so let's go ahead and go up. Uh, we'll take control of the, uh, controls at the end of the ladder. Let's just get it on the fire right now. Uh, that way it's working on it. Okay, so we're good to go there. Hold on, let's go ahead and, uh, should we extend it? You know, it's fine. I think it'll hit it all from here. So let's do our weird, like, crawl animation up to the top. And then we should have another set of controls right here. There we go. Here, let's go up a bit. So maybe we'll start from the top and then move down. Uh, that's probably gonna be the way to do this. So there might be a point in time when I realize that this fire is actually out of control and... Oh, hold on. It's finally started to clear up. I was focused in one area for the longest time and I could not get this thing to clear at all. Okay, we're back in business. Let's start from the top. We'll move down to the bottom. Uh, we'll watch all the people casually just walk in front of a burning building. Uh, not even batting an eye here. Uh, is this... Is this working? Uh, come on. No, it's spreading again. How am I supposed to get this under control? Okay, I got a bit of an idea. So let's let this kind of do its thing up here. Uh, let's get an attack line down here on the bottom and see if we can get in close. Uh, we just got to keep spraying those top uh, floors. So here we go. Let's go ahead and go to fire. Let's get on our SCBA. They even have the little fans now that you actually vent uh, with, which is pretty cool. So let's go water hose. Uh, we just attached to this side. All right. Let's see if we can get this thing taken care of down here. Oh, see, lady, you just, you're right in front of this. How inconvenient is that? Okay, here we go. Yeah, there it is. Oh, can we go inside of this one? No, I, I kind of wish that was a thing. 
Like, it would be so cool to, like, go up the, uh, the staircase and just try to actually take out the fire from the inside. Uh, of course, with the fire raging like this, I'm not sure you would go into the inside. I feel like that would be a, a bit of a bad. Also, I like that there's no longer a progress meter. Like, it used to literally have a progress meter showing you, like, all right, this fire has this much firepower left, and then now it's done. Like, this feels so much more dynamic. Okay, fire on the bottoms, take it out. This feels like a two-person fire here. Like, I am having a lot of issues trying to get this thing under control. Yeah, by the time I do this, it spreads back down. Uh, we need, like, multiple units here. Do I have backup that I can call in? There's a chance this firefighter's just gonna have to walk away from this one. Hold on, work on these. Uh, just trying to cut the fire. Look, it's back on the... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This is definitely a, a multi-person fire right now. Um, the chance I should just, like, walk away from this. Yeah, if you look up here, the, the whole structure is pretty much engulfed in flames. Um, yeah, uh, about that. Hold on, I got an idea. So we're just going to totally, uh, you know, we're going to put this down. And we're gonna just, we're gonna walk back to the station. This is just gonna be officially a firefighter abandons his job because it's too scary and the fire's too big and I don't have any backup here. Uh, maybe we'll have to get the boys back in on this. Okay, this is more like it. We have a, uh, a vehicle fire. So we wanna go ahead and accept that, huh? Let's get, oh, there it goes. All right, so this should be easy. So we don't need the ladder truck for this. We should get right in and uh, take care of this. Let's go code three here. Okay, watch out. So, vehicle fires, they shouldn't have changed too much. I mean, unless it's like up against the structure, and maybe it can catch the structure on fire. Watch out, ding dongs. Okay, looking for a vehicle on fire here. Uh, it's gonna be, it might be behind this business. Uh, let's see, there's an alleyway back there. Uh, maybe we'll head back that way. Uh, yeah, there's, oh yeah, I saw it. Uh, nope, we need to back up here. Yep, totally doing my job right. Oh, watch out, everybody. Uh, fire truck backing up. All right, so if we go this way, uh, it's in an awkward spot. Oh, can we pull between these? Yeah, we can. Uh, oh, I should have some water on the truck, so I don't think I'll have to actually hook into a, uh, a hose. It's not like a huge fire, but still. All right, let's go ahead and take this out real quick. Uh, we could probably do it with a, uh, no, I, I would say we could do it with a fire extinguisher if they still have it. Let's go ahead and just hook into the truck. Uh, so let's get our SCBA on and then we are going to get the water hose and then we'll just hook in here to the side and let's start working on this bad boy. All right. So yeah, we have plenty of water in this truck. I don't think that's going to be a, any bit of a concern. Uh, let's start from one end and then we'll just work our way to the other uh, kind of hit it from all angles. Actually, the inside's on fire, too. All right, so just spray through the windows there. We don't see a person, do we? No, I, I don't think that's a thing right now. Uh, unlike the first call where we yeeted somebody. Oh, let's hit the front end. All right, go through the windows here. Oh, see, this is what I'm talking about. This is the easy calls here. Still says there's a, a little bit of fire haunt spray in. Can we open up the doors? Is that a thing? Hold on, just spray through it real quick. Yeah, I would swear the fire, there it goes. I was about to say, I think the fire is taken care of here. We pretty much just did a full 360 around it. Was this your van? I feel like this was her van. Hold on, let's make sure she does, she's not on fire either. There we go. Nice. So I'm not really sure what we learned here today. We learned that the fire update is pretty awesome. If you guys want to check it out, it is available now. And we'll see you guys next time.